Mom! I turned Daddy into a frog! You have to kiss him now. Welcome to Undertale Comic TV. Make sure to subscribe and turn on notifications. That way you'll never miss a video. Enjoy! Wanna... watch a film? Uh, sure. Should I do something? Hey nerds, what are you watching? I'm gonna hang with you for a while. What? Oh, enemy place! So touching. Damn it. It was a date?! It didn't even look like that at all! Sit closer, damn it! I think my spine is broken! My... too. Welcome to... Croopies! Holy s***, he's so small! What the fuck? How am I supposed to protect this small blue bean and keep him safe forever? Oh my gosh, I can't handle the level of cuteness, I really can't handle it! One... It's too much, it's too cute! Catch him, please. Uh, I can't believe how much I'm rambling. Oh my... Freaking glob! Here you go! I'll treasure it with my life! Uh, he's too good for this world! <laughs> A job well done by Tiny Grilby! <laughs> Sans, do you like ketchup? Sans X ketchup. Yeah, well, pretty much. But why do you have to ship me with that thing? It's not like I'm gonna fall in love with it. Sans Undertale! So... You hate Sans, right, Monica? <laughs> so, Sans. Since I'm pretty sure you can see Monica glitch out, on a scale of 1 to 10, how creepy can her glitches get? Seems like she reminds me of Erisans. <laughs> Bitch! Who's Where are Natsuku, Yuri, and Sayori? Well, they must be somewhere else. Also, who the fuck is Natsuku? Hey, Sans and Monica. Ever heard of perv levels? I don't know, and I don't want to know. What has four letters, but sometimes has nine letters, but never has five letters? Ooh, I hope you get this. Uh... Hey, Monica. This time, try to be nice with Sans, okay? That's it. Okay. Hey, Monica. Who's your favorite character in Undertale? Except Sans. Uh... Frisk. Monica, ask Sans if he wants a bad time. Do you want to have a bad time? Elmeo, are you okay? Does Monica know that the girls are here? What? Where? I don't see it. Oh, that's right. They don't exist. Monica, would you kiss a skeleton? No. Hey, Monica, can you delete me? Oh, well? Yes, and. Monica, do you know what Sancest is? So, what Monica think about Fontcest? Rip Monica's ears. I'm ho- I'm so, so, so sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I made a big mistake. Huh? What's wrong, buddy? I... I... Omae wa mo... Shinderu! Friss, don't tell me you... I failed the cake for our first anniversary! 
Oh? You're sure, it's delicious. Phew. It's completely charred! Coal taste, my favorite. Sands! <sighs> There's nothing more pleasant than watching the starry sky. I don't know who saved you from the river, but when I searched for you, I couldn't find you. Tori was the one who saved you in the ruins when a monster was chasing you. Then why did she run away from me when I got inside the house? She sent me to watch you and take care of you. But now that I know your sister is also in the kingdom, it is better to talk with Tori directly. Where's the queen? She lives in the secret refuge in Snowden. Don't worry, we'll get there fast. What if your brother catches us? We have a big lead. If we don't stop for a long time, we shouldn't have problems. How did you arrive in this kingdom? My sister went to Mount Abbott looking for Gaster. I was looking for her and fell into this kingdom by accident. I'm not even sure my sister is in this kingdom. If she's looking for Gaster, it's most likely she actually is in this kingdom. However, I have no idea where he might be. Do you know Gaster? Hmm, uh, let's say I do, but as I said, it's been at least a couple years since anyone heard from him. He stayed to live here in this kingdom after the catastrophe. He's probably just hiding somewhere. After all, he can't leave this kingdom thanks to the barrier. Wait, there's no exit? It's complicated to explain. Uh, for now, what matters is finding your sister. Yeah, it looks like we've arrived. I can see snow in the distance. Here's where Papyrus caught me by surprise. We're lucky. If we hurry up, we can get to the town today. Are you hungry? I know the perfect place to eat. <coughs> Princess! I just wanted to hear the message of these flowers before they caught me. Wait! Wait! Don't touch it! It is strange for me to speak so much with a flower. But it seems that you are the only one to which I can speak of this stuff. My mother and I moved to an old house near Snowden, the furthest away possible from the castle. It appears she doesn't think of forgiving my parents, always blames them for the war and the shame we have now. But sometimes I wish she would explain to me the why. She always says she will tell me when I'm older. The knight moved in with us, only a few years older than me, but he is very strong with the sword. He is the personal guard of my mother, but she insists on him training me to defend myself. It's the voice of Asriel. It's strange to talk so much with a flower, but it seems you're the only one whom I can talk about these things. My mother and I moved to an old house near Snowden, the furthest away possible from the castle. Maybe they were my only friends. I would like to remember the hours we spent together. I want to remember the good times. The happy days I spent with my family in the other kingdom, but... I only 